So today I'm going live with uh, Dysphoria, which is a new intermediate 7 exit Kaizo hack by Shovda. And this hack's a little bit different from the description. It seems to be uh, like a kind of like a different kind of expression for the ROM hack medium so far in so far of what I've played. It, it's like very personal and emotional. It's going to kind of give us a look as an expression of feelings of gender dysphoria as felt by Shavda. So I'm kind of excited and uh, intrigued to see see what this ROM hack's all about. So let's get right into it. All right, I think uh, this is the first level. Yeah, we can't move on the overworld. And the first level is sometimes my body doesn't feel like my body. Let's get in there, let's check it out. I want a world where I can be who I am. I want to exist in a way that doesn't hurt. As everyone should be able to. Oh! Alright. Oh, we gotta eat the bullet, okay. Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? All right, I gotta eat the spring and then get on the fuzzy. Okay. Yeah, like that. All right. So let's, uh, we can respawn this guy. So let's eat the spring. Respawn. No, I tried to bounce on him one more time. Okay, that that was close. That was close. So we gotta spit the spring and then go for an earlier regrab to the right, and then we're we don't know what's after this uh, hot head, but we know what we gotta do there. Ooh. No, I I did I somehow bonked the muncher, but didn't lose speed. I didn't actually get bonked. I like did a full jump over that platform. I don't think I've ever had that happen before where I like hit an object or, like a tile, take damage from it but don't lose any speed. All right, full jump, full jump, full jump, full jump. Full jump. Alright, well we can... Dot. Okay, there's the goal. So we just need to get there with Yoshi and that's the end. Alright. I wonder if it's somehow possible to spin up through that Koopa and kill it. Probably not. Because it's like fully on the one tile. Whoa, the spring isn't here. And what's that in the ground? Is that a shell with Goomba eyes? The fuck? Are we seeing this? Spring is still there? It is! Amazing! Oh my god, when I spat it out, what happened? <laughs> oh, that was interesting. <laughs> and then you gotta find a bunch of extra inputs to fix it. It only takes one input to, to break it, but it takes a bunch more to fix it. Wait. 
Oh, I didn't want to kill the Koopa. I wanted to let the Koopa live, but we got it. We got it. I wanted to let that Koopa just live. Alright, we did it. That's the first exit down. That was fun. I struggled with it, but I had a good time. So let's up our exit count to one. Thanks for the G's. Hardest level done. Nice. Next up, sometimes it feels like I'm not in control. Let's let's check it out. I've been sleepwalking through my life since I can remember. Alright, we got beans. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, I know how to do this. I know how to do this. I'm going to mess it up, but... Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, I don't... Whew. Okay. <laughs> Made it through. Oh, and then I fell through without triggering the bean. Damn, I did one really precise move and then died in a super precise way. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay, that was close. Alright. Oh, I didn't hit left in time. Alright, so then we're going left, falling right. And we got a nice little one tile escape jump over there. I like this. This is looking really fun. Okay. All right. Oh, what is this? All right. Can I? Oh no! Okay, there's the goal. So we just block jump onto the bean, do a really careful- I should go all the way left on this bean for a min jump. I don't need to be in the center of this bean. And then it's another, like, bean walk, and then, like, a nice re-grab to the end. Okay, PB. Okay. No! PB! PB. I should have checked my jump height a few more times before going for it. Oof, that was close. Alright. No, that's not gonna work. Closer! <laughs> Closer! Whew, in there. All right. We got it. That was a very cool level. I like that one a lot. That might be my fa That's my favorite level so far. That's all I can say is I really, really enjoyed that level. Very cool. All right, let's update our exit counter. Thanks for the Gs. That puts us at two. Two exits. All right, next up is sometimes I can't connect with other men. Let's check it out. 
Everyone else makes friends so easily. Everyone else forgets that I exist. We got vines. And chucks. Oh, constantly bouncing chucks. Not constantly bouncing chucks. Ooh, okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> PB. This is, uh, this is something. <laughs> Hmm. Maybe it's a walk-off. Maybe I can go right away. Go, go, go. Oh! Oh! I need to... Stall? Stall? Like, do, like, forward, stop. Stop and go. Like, forward, stop. Forward, stop forward stop like the platform has to fall enough or I walk maybe I just walk don't even hold the run button maybe we're just walking <laughs> oh shit Oh no, PB. All right, all right, that was good. Barely hit this this swooper. So then I have to do like a go over the spike and barely hit the chuck without touching that spike. And I'm wondering if that's the final jump. Like I'm going to have to go up and over and then hit that chuck on its right side and without hitting the spike and just like launch towards the goal maybe. Oof. Okay. In there! Nice. I was very close to not hitting that chuck. I don't know how many pixels of chuck head were above the spikes when I made contact there, but it couldn't have been many. Could not have been many. All right. Let's update our exit counter. That's three. Thanks for the G's. All right. Um, I think we'll call it here for the day and not start the next one yet. So we'll, uh, we'll pick up with sometimes I can't connect with anything next time. All right, last time we played, we beat the third level. Sometimes I can't connect with other men. And we're moving on to level four. Sometimes I can't connect with anything. Let's check it out. What's it like to be at peace with your body, to feel like you belong there? Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, no more boo. Okay. What's next? Yeah, that's death. Okay. Hopefully this lines up. No, 
it didn't line up. Okay. But we can try again. Oh god, okay. You know what? Let's uh, okay, I wanted to make sure it's not a troll. I hit the switch and then I'm screwed. Okay. Oh no! I didn't expect to charge through the spike! I thought it I thought it would work differently than that. Okay, PB. No, okay, is that it? I don't know, there might be another section after that. I got to go really slow when I hit the chuck. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, this is terrifying. No, I almost... I fell through that somehow and then was utterly shocked that I didn't get hit and did not recover. <laughs> If I just let myself fall, I would have snuck through that boo ring somehow. Oh, PB. PB. more shit oh I'm nervous <laughs> This is so scary. Oh, fuck. Oh, that was close. That's a bad cycle. Okay. Don't get hit by the football now. Okay, just stay under. 
Oh, okay, in there. We didn't get the message box. We didn't get the message box. Ooh, that was terrifying. All right, let's update our X account. That's four. Ooh, four exits down. Thanks for the, uh, the G's. We have Smiler's Overworld. All right, next level is sometimes my face looks like someone else's. Let's check it out. Oh, fishing boo, okay. Who is this man staring back at me? I don't know him. I don't know him. I don't want to know him. Oh, okay. Oops. Okay, I want to pull the fishing boot left and then completely pass it. No, all right, there's the ending. All right. So you got to get on the spring. Then we go, we, I'll probably do a spin jump off the spring. And then I just have to bounce off the fishing booze until I see an opening to fall through, get the key, hit the keyhole. All right, PB. I just keep getting more excited for it. Down, jump. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh, God, how am I not dead? How am I not dead? Okay, there we go. I was certain I was going to die like three flame turns before that. I just like lived by a pixel each time. Okay, do not fast fall. I feel like I got that as quickly as I reasonably could, and it, the window's not big enough. Even if I had done that a few, like a little bit earlier, I don't think I would have had the time to grab the key and turn to the keyhole before the flame swept through and killed me. So, yeah, I think I need to do one bounce. What I could do is I could bounce on the top fishing boo go over to the left and then bounce back to the right like manually pull them or I could delay my rightward motion when I go up on the spring instead of immediately going over the muncher like almost like kind of go up into the left and then do like a big bounce to the right and try to fast fall again after pulling them more to the left so I have some ideas I have some ideas that's PB went a little early In there. Oof. That ending's that ending's scary. That was a that was a really good level. Let's uh, update our exit counter. That's five. Five out of seven. All right. Next up is sometimes my skin crawls like worms. Let's check it out. As I say, I need to escape this body to erupt like a disgusting flower. Wait, I think I have to midair that. Okay. All right. Ooh. Okay, we got a new spiny. Ooh, okay. That bottom plant probably isn't... I probably don't need to bounce off of it. Alright, PB.
Oh, okay. I just I went a little too early. I gotta do one extra bounce on the plant. Okay, BB. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, I didn't do it, but it's okay. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Oops. Alright, I will like bucketed myself with the spiny here, because I'm a fool. And then I would go to the next dry bones. And then I'd have to, like, go to the right and then swerve down. But I'd want to go up to the second dry bones as late as possible, like when the spiny's entering the yellow blocks. Okay. What the fuck? Okay, the, there's a projectile spiny in this level. PB. Uh, I think that's a dry bones bone reskinned as a spiny. I think that's a thrown bone spiny. Oh my god. Okay. I was not expecting potaboos, so I got a fast fall onto the potaboo. Okay, PB. Ooh, we made it in there. All right. I was wondering how much would be left. That was tough. That was cool. I like the like having to think about all the spawns and stuff, but it was very very tough. All right, that's one more exit down. Let's update our exit counter. Thanks for the G's. Puts us at six. Six out of seven. One to go. All right. The final level. Sometimes it doesn't feel like things will get better. Let's check it out. What am I supposed to do when even the pleading hurts? Song of Healing. Very good choice. Okay, I gotta double hit that. So then I want to hit the shell and then re-grab off of it. I don't think I want to do a big jump. I think I just want to re-grab off the shell to the right. Oh my god. There's a plant there? That was I would have not have I would not have foreseen. Yeah, I, I would not have guessed. <laughs> Okay, okay, so we do the back shot, uh, bounce up, grab the shell, shell jump off the on-off switch, go over, uh, sh land, shell jump off the on-off switch again maybe, and then bounce on the swooper. Oh my god! What? We're going on fish now? Alright, PB. Oh, 
Oh my. Oh, I couldn't land on the ledge. I couldn't land on the ledge. Alright, PB. Okay. I literally cannot see where I'm going. Um. No! Oh, I didn't mean to tap it. Okay, so I'm just riding it on the bottom. Like, land on it, ride it. Then, as I get close to the top, jump over and do the same- I'm guessing do the same thing on the next one. Oh shit, that scared me. Okay, I need to be on the far right side of that ball so that when that other one swings down, I'm above it. Or I need to bounce up earlier and hug the left wall and be on and then curve to the right. I'm not sure if I want to stay on the ball and just be really far to the right. And then just like do a, a, a big jump and switch. All right, PB. All right, what if we do this? We go up, bounce on this, then ride this one down. Oh my god, no! <laughs> I should have expected it. Well, there's the goal. That's PB. <laughs> that is PB. I respect the hell out of this fish. That was a good one, Shavda. I respect it. Alright, let's go again. There it is. There it is. Oof. That was a tough, tough section. Yo, thanks for the GG. I think that's it. That's uh, the end of Dysphoria. There's no credits level. I really like this hack. I thought it was really fun. Very challenging on the 1.0 version. Very cool, chill music, chill like obstacles. Very immersive. I like, like I was saying earlier, I really like the idea of it being like a form, like a ROM hack can be a form of like self-expression beyond like, here's a, here's my favorite jumps or my favorite gameplay trope or this and that. It's like, you know, it's more profound, it's deeper, it's more of like a personalized self-expression. I think that's really cool. But yeah, I had a great time. Thanks for making this, Shavda. I uh, really enjoyed it. Definitely uh, will remember this ROM hack. But yeah, that's that's the end of Dysphoria. Very cool.